What's the first thing I have to do? Who can tell me? My arms are already defending the arm bar, right? Yes? Okay, so what's the first thing I have to do here, guys? This is not the first time I've gone over this technique. No, not in this position here. Yes, okay, bridge. However, can I bridge from where I am here? Is it gonna do anything to him? No, no. So what's my, what would be my reason for, to bridge? To go ahead and, and make some space and Oh, we talked about this before, Sorry. guys. What's to the reason for the bridge? Take him off balance. Ah, take him off balance, right? So if I bridge from here, look, is that taking him off balance? No. So I gotta get here. Now, if I bridge from here, is it going off balance? Yes. Ah, okay. Do me a favor, guys, turn off the radio over there, please. So that's first, right? If my legs are like this, sort of far away from his, where his hips are and I try to bridge, it's not gonna really do much. Because I can bridge here all I want. It's not gonna knock him off balance. What I have to do is I have to be close enough to him here so that my legs can get really tight to where his hips are. And as soon as I bridge, knock him over sideways like this here. Never to see that there, yes? Okay, so what's next? Step over. Ah, okay, so let's go back for a second. Why step over and not under in this position? <laughs> Because we always talk about like there's a time to step under, there's a time to step over. So why would I step over in here instead of stepping under? If you step under, it's gonna go ahead and be Well, watch what happens here, right? It's you're kind of on the right track, Rudy. But from this position, look, if I rotate, there's no reason for me to try to keep his his hips heavy. Uh, my my hips heavy on his legs. So if I go like this and bring this leg under, look how I end up. This is not a strong position for me to be in. But if I get here, and I step over. Now look where I am. Now my other leg here right away has to bring down so that my knee is very close to where his butt is over here. And here I can start lifting, lifting, and my arm can come out real simple there. So what's the last piece of this puzzle? So I stay here and get omoplatted. Well, really, can I get omoplatted from this position? No, because I'm really, I'm holding on to the back of his leg here, so he really can't. If my arm was like this, then maybe he might be able to set that up. I'm, Kind of controlling his leg here. So the last piece of this puzzle is just me switching my hip to get control and then coming back here, all right? So ideally, what I have to do is this. I'm gonna show you it without uh, him holding, right? Whatever arm he's gonna try to arm on, I have to hold my bicep. The other one has to go under his thigh. I move my uh, legs really close to his hips and then I bridge as hard as I can to knock him over. As Soon as I knock him over, my knee is gonna go down to the floor. I step one and then I bring my knee really close to his butt. Once my knee goes close to his butt, it should be very easy for me to lift. This arm will stay holding onto the leg. My arm will come out. You all right? Make sense to you guys? So I'm going to do it again really, really slow so you guys can see the position here. The beginning? Yeah. So here, you know, my arms will be tight. He'll get the arm. I'm starting to block already. He's going over, and I'm holding the back of his knee here. Now, why do I control the back of his knee like this here? And not like, you know, just, you know, like this. Yeah, so like if I do this and he moves his leg, now I'm gonna get arm barred right away, right? But if I do this and I hold and it goes to move that leg, now I can follow that up. And it's a lot easier for me to control the position from there. All right, does it make sense to you guys? Yes, all right, so just one more time, we'll break it down and then we'll see if you guys can do it really well, all right? So he'll get the arm bar, I'll hold my hands covering my face already. Now, legs close to him. Now I bump so that I knock him over sideways. One, step over two, balls of the foot here, guys. Knee comes in, start stretch. Now he can try to hold on to my arm all he wants. Tap, swing to the back, get control of the position. All right? Sir, sir. Good sir. Everybody? sir. Anybody have any questions with that? Yes, no. You sure? Sorry. All right, let's get him, guys. One, two, three, let's go.